Hey everybody, Jack Boyles with Steam Engines USA and I'm continuing part two of the video with our twin uh, Walesco D32 steam engines. Uh, if you watched our last video, we went over basically the controls, setting up, uh, filling them up, lubing all the joints and prepping them to run them, all the processes I guess involved. So now we're actually going to run them. And my engines are, are starting to warm up you can see the pressure over here on the limited edition 2017 D32 Walesco is up to about uh, 0 0.5. Uh, and I think the red line on it is 1.5. So I imagine if I open the whistle up, we'll hear a little steam. Yes. All right. All of my valves are closed. We have oil. It is lubed up, ready to go. If you don't know how to lube up one of these engines or the process, go check out part one of this video on these two. And I'm super excited. And it's getting warm. I'm super excited because I've never run these two engines before. Um, and I've been collecting steam engines for almost seven years, but I've personally never run a D32. I've had this particular D32 steam engine, it's from 1960s era, and I've had it for probably four years maybe. Um, this one I've had about two and a half years, and it came in this really cool collector box over here. So if you ever get a chance to own one of these, it's got a laser engraved box. Well, let's go. It's got a, a really cool design in it. And it's a very well-made box. It has latches. It has hooks on the end to carry it um, inside of the box. Let me move it back. This is goes with the 1960 one, and this is the lubricant for the new one. It comes with a little sales brochure. It's got different ones in it. To identify your steam engine then it's got a certificate of authenticity and steam engine d32 limited edition 272 very nice and then the engine goes in here and there's some bolts coming up through the bottom with flywheel um, uh, wing nuts and you just snug it down and put everything in the box so it makes super nice storage so I really like the fact that you have that box right there to go with the steam engine it's really cool so I can hear it over here oh we got water coming out the, the bottom there Maybe it's overflowing now. I have to check that out. I'm letting some steam off of that one. Let's open this one up. There we go. All right. Looks like we are moving now. I'll slow this one down just a little bit. It got going really fast. Okay. I'm going to open this one up just a little bit. Oh, let me cut this on. Oh, looking good. You know I'm asking for excitement when I try running in two of these at one time and I've never run one before, so bear with me. This is pretty cool. So we've got our steam's been released. It's coming out. This one over here is just humming along perfectly. Slow down and engage this over here.
And at this one over here, I see I've got a little bit of a leak I'm gonna have to address. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pause it, let me cut it off. Close the valves. All right. And then let's see what's going on over here. Something's happening there. Put this back on. And I'll come back to that one. Looks like I'm going to have to do a little, uh, give it a little bit of love and attention. 